Hello everybody, what we're going to do today is a continuation of, I guess, what we've been doing previously. We're going to solve equations. Now, this time the equation is going to be a little bit more complicated. So, what we're going to do with this one is we're going to solve this equation here. Now, we want to know what x would be. What number for x would make this whole number sentence, this equation, true? So, step by step, we'll unpack it until we get to x equal something, which will be the solution. Now, the first thing I've done is to rewrite my equation from up here to down here. The next thing I'm going to do is to times by 3. Now, if I times by 3 each side, well, 8 times 3 is 24. And you see how I've got times by 3 and divide by 3 here. These are opposites and cancel out. So I can even put a cross through them if I like. And I'll be left over on this left-hand side with 5x plus 4. What do I need to do next to get x on its own? Well, I'll probably need to get rid of this plus 4. Now, the opposite of a plus 4 is a minus 4. So, I have minus 4 on each side, so I've kept my equation balanced by doing the same thing to both sides. Plus 4, minus 4 are opposites, and we'll cancel out. And we'll just leave me with 4x on the left-hand side. 24 take away 4 will leave me 20. So I'm almost there. And you'll notice that each step, when I started with this, the equation looked quite complicated. After I multiplied on both sides by 3, the equation looked a little bit better. Now that I've added or taken away 4 on both sides, the equation looks even easier here. How can I solve for x here to get x equals 2? Well, between... The 5 and the x is a times. The opposite of a times is a divide. So I think I'll divide by 4 on both sides. Times by 5, divide by 5. They're opposites, and we'll cancel out. So it'll just leave the x. 20 divided by 5 is 4. So the answer will be x equals 4. Now I might just check to make sure that my when I put in x, I get 8 out. So... 5 times 4, now in place of x I'll put in 4, plus 4 divided by 3. 5 times 4 is 20, 20 plus 4 divided by 3, 24 divided by 3, 8, which is what it should be. Alrighty everybody, well I hope that helped and I'll see you in class.